Hello everyone, I am Karuna and welcome back to my channel. Because of pandemic, a lot of work is happening from home and people are constantly engaged in their Zoom and video meeting. But the challenge is, since you are operating from home, there are certain rules and some guidelines and some ideas that you should keep in mind so as to appear professional in your Zoom meeting. So in this video, I'm going to give you the same advices. My tips are divided into two parts. One is the technical part and second is the fashion part. So the first part, I'll talk about the setup, the sound, the lights and all these aspects. And in the second part, I'll talk about the appearance and dressing. Like the first thing is keep in mind about the light, light on your face. So either try to sit in front of the window so that you get the light on your face, not like the way I'm sitting, or else if you have any light, LED light in your house, the light should fall on your face. So keep that in mind. Second one is if you tend to sit ahead of the wall, that's the best option to do because there would not be any distractions from behind. But if you are sitting right in the middle of your living room or some place like that, then make sure that no one is walking past you so that it's not a distraction in your video call. Otherwise, you will have your family members or your maid just, you know, coming close to you and appearing in your Zoom call. If you have doorbell ringing and the Zoom call is very important, make sure that you instruct the people not to ring the doorbell or you can turn the switch off. So that is mainly important if you are appearing on TV or any kind of video meeting that's getting broadcast. Next advice is if your room is very dirty and you are sitting right in the middle of the house and you don't want to clean air or you are sitting on your bed which you want not to show in your Zoom call, then you have this interesting option given by the Zoom technology in which you can choose your own backdrop. So I'll just show you how to do that. So these are the few steps that you can follow. Now about the fashion aspect. This is my interesting part. I have divided my fashion tips into four different tips. Okay, so here's how we go. First tip is style yourself with some statement neck piece. A why statement neck piece? Because you know only the top part is going to be visible. So you want to make that style statement and draw attention to you and make people hear you through your that look in a small window in your Zoom call. So by statement neck piece, I'm showing you multiple options here. So one is the layered neck piece, others is the neck piece made of gemstones, but make sure that they are appropriate for formal occasions. The second aspect is about the layering. So look at this. Now I'm not wearing leg piece over here because I'm wearing a fantastic blazer. So wearing a layer creates a contrast around your neck and draws attention to your neck and also shows that authoritative image because layer is an indication of authority. Keep that in mind. So you can either wear an interesting blazer over it or you can also wear other kinds of beautiful ethnic jacket like the one I'm wearing. It can be half sleeves or full sleeves. Or you can also wear a blazer over your kurta because that looks interesting too. So mixing and matching of moods and vibes and styles also creates a look. My third tip is if you are attending a meeting for a uh, something stylish like i go for this mrs india meetings wherein you have fashion community or style community appearing then you can go for one shoulder or a smart spaghetti sleeves with some chunky neck piece my next important tip is wearing a scarf yes since you're operating from home which has ac on you can always wear a scarf around your neck because it instantly boosts up your image from you know very very casual to formal drawing attention to your face and you know showing that beautiful creative scarf around your neck. My next important tip is wearing a sari. Yes, sari because of the triangle it creates around your neck is an amazing outfit to wear in a zoom call because it has the style appearing with your blouse and the, the sari and the border on the top half of your body. So I'm wearing the one, the beautiful sari with a border and with a black blouse. So creating a wonderful contrast near my face. So these were my tips that you can keep in mind while appearing for your teams. Bye-bye. God bless. Take care. Happy meetings.